Hey guys, what's going on? This is Liam here. Hope you're doing well. Um, I don't know if you guys saw my Instagram, but I'm taking a break at the moment. So, a lot of healing to do, a lot of relaxation. I've been doing the tinnitus thing, helping people for over two years now. Every day, all day email. So if you've tried to email, you would have got the automatic response. If you tried to send me a message on Facebook or you know comments on YouTube or a direct message on Instagram, you would have obviously gotten no response. Um, so uh, obviously, thankfully, the healing tied in with um, the exact same time as the lockdown. So I don't know how your Corona situation is going, but in mine, obviously, it's just you can't be out in groups of more than two people. You can't go to the beach. You can't go to parks. Um, you can only leave the house for you know like sort of pharmaceutical stuff or anything like that. That's like me. Thankfully, I've got. Um, these bad boys on so I've actually got a disabled <laughs> a disabled parking sticker so I'm classified as disabled now so I guess I guess that's awesome um, anyway so hope you guys are doing well I'm still gonna be um, away for a couple of months but thankfully I've still got all my videos up so obviously you can just watch those and get the answers just remember to apply my advice but I apply it after you speak with doctors don't eat for four hours before bed um, don't start with fasting uh, fix your diet and lifestyle, invest in some blue blocker glasses, and I hope you guys are doing well. So, oops, so obviously I made a video, sorry, I made a post on Instagram, but some of you guys have followed me there, so I thought I'd make this extremely late video, tell you guys I'm okay, everything's fine, I hope you're doing well. And remember, in this time of isolation, don't waste it, it's sort of a, a gift. Hopefully you're not sick or your family members aren't sick, I really hope that everyone's okay, but use it to learn something. Do a bit of research on a mitochondria, do a bit of research on the stuff that I've found and I've been sharing. So watch the videos again, watch the Instagram again. Sign up for my free ebook um, below. Uh, open the email, start learning, but start applying as well. I see a common, a common uh, situation where people will, um, how do you say, they'll apply, they won't apply anything because when they think that they have the answer, they'll sit there and just dwell on it and think about it and they won't actually apply it because they, they think, oh, well, I can fix this anytime. It's a, it's a weird psychological thing and I'm not a psychologist, so I don't know the name for it. But, you know, just just try, like, you know, how can I say this? Like, I'm on, I'm a lot of, I'm on a lot of pain meds at the moment, so obviously, you know, that might sound a little bit weird, but I'm really just trying to get the same point across. Um, and here's something cool too, my tinnitus didn't come back. After all the surgery, being pumped with antibiotics, being pumped with pain meds, getting no sleep, being on sleep medications such as Stillnox, being totally wiped out, lack of sun. This is not a sunny day, this is very overcast, but obviously I'm still going out and getting the sun, as you should too. I'm eating seafood, the DHA. Uh, acid will increase my ability to absorb the sun and use it, use electrons, protons, all sorts of stuff, electrons, turn the protons in the body. Okay, very cool stuff. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are trying and applying something. I hope you guys are giving yourself time. You can't reverse tinnitus in just months if you've fucked your body for 40 plus years, okay? Don't apply two things and think, this doesn't work, okay? Maybe you're not working hard enough, okay? And I'm saying that because lots of people just, they're, they're pretty weak, okay? And that, it is really true. And so you really gotta stick to it, be a bit stronger, uh, be with it in the long term and know that I'm here to support you, okay? I'm not going to be your best friend, but I'm going to be the friend that you need. So, good fucking luck. I love you all and I hope none of you get sick with the coronavirus. And if you are following my advice, okay, and taking the iodine and the selenium and you're exercising and getting sun, do you think you're going to be more likely to get it? And if you get it, do you think you're going to be more likely to um, succeed and survive through it? What do you think? Have a think about it, okay? So, I've been spending more time in hospitals than anyone I know, apart from nurses and doctors, is in the ER and the, in the ICU around other people being touched by nurses all day long in hospitals where patients have corona, and I didn't get it, okay? So have a think about that, increase your immune system, have a cold shower, and good luck, guys.